Hi, welcome to the discussion of isometric views of simple solids. Under this, we are discussing now construction of isometric view of pentagonal prism. The given problem is draw isometric view of a pentagonal prism of base side 30 mm and axis 70 mm when its base is on VP and axis parallel to HP. Here, the prism is resting on its base on VP. So, front view is a pentagonal shape and axis parallel to VP. So, top view is a rectangular shape. So, we have to draw the orthographic projections that is front view as well as top view of a pentagonal prism. So, in front view, we will get base of the pentagonal prism that is pentagonal shape. Top view will get rectangle shapes. After drawing the front view as well as uh, top view, then what we have to do is we have to enclose the base that is pentagonal shape in a rectangle. Name this one as 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4, 1. That means two bases. Then after that, we have to copy this rectangle into isometric view. We have to construct rectangle 1, 2, 3, 4 and 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4, 1 in isometric views. So, as this 1, 2, 3, 4 rectangle is uh, parallel to the vertical plane, then sides 1, 2 as well as 3, 4 are parallel to the vertical plane, 2, 3 and 1, 4 are parallel to the horizontal plane. The sides which are parallel to the horizontal plane are tilted with an inclination of 30 degrees to the ground line and the sides which are parallel to the vertical plane are tilted with an angle of 90 degrees to the ground line. So, first we will keep point 3 on the ground then draw z axis y axis say z y as rectangle is uh, resting on uh, point 3 on the ground then 3 2 3 2 is horizontal which is making an angle 30 degrees to the ground line then with compass 3 to as radius 3 as center draw an arc then 3 4 as radius draw an arc after that say 2 3 4 we have to locate point 1 for that parallel to 2 3 we have to draw 1 4 or parallel to 3 4 we can draw 2 1 that is parallel to 3 4 
say 1 and parallel to 2 3 1 4 after that this is the base of a rectangle now as the axis is parallel to the horizontal plane as we are tilting all horizontal lines are with an inclination of 30 degrees to the ground line then draw 30 degrees inclination line towards right say x after that with the given axis length say 7 say 3 1 then parallel to 3 4 passing through 3 dry line that means we are constructing the box the method itself is called box method parallel to 3 3 1 passing through 4 dry line similarly passing through 1 also dry line then passing through 2 also dry line after that parallel to 2 3 passing through 3 1 then parallel to 1 2 this is 1 1 and this is 2 1 join 2 1 and 3 1 and this is 4 1 the method which we are using is box method that is after drawing the front tube with the given axis length we have to draw 30 degrees inclination lines towards right parallel to 3 3 1 draw a line passing through 4 4 1 parallel to 4 4 1 1 1 1 parallel to that again 2 2 1 after that all lines are light lines only finally we will dark the required lines later then to be as radius to as center similarly 3c also with the same radius even here also to one q1 also with the same radius next two a as radius two as center similarly three d also with the same radius next here also three s two q next 4e and 41t after that what we have to do is join all front two points as dark lines and rear side either they visible or not visible based upon that we have to draw either continuous lines or light lines 
वन आई मीन ये बी सी डी ई नेक्स्ट पी क्यू आर एस टी जॉइन ए बी बी सी सी डी डी ए as the observer is looking in this direction then front base is fully visible then the outer face edge ds is continuous cr also continuous face edge cr also continuous next ET also continues and then AP also continues then BQ is hidden and then rear side base edge rs continuous st continuous pt continuous pq is dotted qr also dotted here in the case of this pentagonal uh, prism base is uh, vertical that's why you'll get like this and axis is uh, parallel to the horizontal plane that's why we have to draw axis lines parallel to the 30 degrees inclination lines first we'll start with the base then we'll move towards the face edges then as we are seeing front view in this way then total this base is visible rear side some of the base edges are not visible those edges are shown like a dotted lines that's about the construction of pentagonal prism when the base is uh, on vp and axis parallel to hp i hope everyone understood well thank you